This is a demonstration of the Ultra 2 DTEC from EMX Industries. Uh, the Ultra 2 DTEC is an inductive loop detector. Uh, the, in this demonstration, we have connected the three of the Ultra 2 DTECs to three individual loops using the EMX Ultra 2 motherboard. And the wiring harness is used to supply power and bring the uh, external relay contacts out to the connections in the operator. The Ultra 2, all of the EMX Ultra 2 DTECs and other Ultra DTECs from EMX uh, provide four different uh, frequency settings for the loops high, medium high, medium low, and low. And there's two dip switches that are used to control or set those frequencies. Currently on all three of the loop detectors I have the frequencies set identically and they are currently set to medium high. The sensitivity switch is the level at which a vehicle will be detected so the change in frequency uh, needs to be high enough that it would trigger each of the detectors and this is the adjustment for that feature. Uh, I want to demonstrate really the use of the uh, ultrameter on the Ultra DTEC. The, the ultrameter uh, displays or indicates the appropriate sensitivity setting uh, to detect a vehicle that is positioned on the loop. So when a vehicle pulls up to the loop, a value shows up on the display and as long as I turn or adjust the, uh, the uh, sensitivity setting, it'll detect that vehicle. So if it if I get a value that's lower than the setting, it does not detect. So the other, let's try to show each one of these. Remember the frequency is set the same on all of these currently. So one of the nice features of the ultrameter is that it can be used to identify or detect a situation where there's crosstalk between two channels. Uh, when there's crosstalk between uh, two loops, that can occur when the loops are in close proximity to each other and they're operating at the same frequency. So that is one of the features of the Ultra Detect is you're able to identify that type of a situation and you can change the frequency setting on one of the loops and we'll hit a reset on that one since we changed it. And when it's finished doing a frequency count, we'll see that there's no longer any interference between those loops. So now when the vehicle pulls up that loop and the second loop and the third loop are now not, no longer, the first and second loop are no longer interfering with each other. So that is the uh, demonstration of the ultrameter on the Ultra DTEC uh, family of products from EMX Industries.